Okay, good uh, afternoon. Today we're going to be doing slope. This is an Algebra 2 class, so it's going to start in Algebra 1 topics, and then it's going to go quickly into Algebra 2. So hold on to your horses if you brought them. Um, okay, so uh, you know, as we do every time, repeat after me, make me feel really good. Yay, math! <laughs> I'm... Really? Yeah! yeah! Oh, okay, time release. Like Alka Seltzer. <laughs> <laughs> no, but we don't endorse this product. How long have you been planning that joke? <laughs> Zero seconds. <laughs> Zero seconds. It's called an Alka Seltzer breaker. Okay. Icebreaker. Oh. <laughs> yeah, yeah. See, I don't plan them. I don't plan them. Yeah. All right, so we're gonna talk about sloppy joke. Yeah. <laughs> Two jokes in succession. So you've heard of slope before, right? It's what over what. They start with ours. Rise over run. Rise over run. Let's talk about it. Rise. Y. Rise has to do with x or y. Y. Yes, Y. And so a fun little trick, rise is the Y's. Okay? So let's say I was starting at this point. <laughs> How far is my rise to this point? Count them up. A one, one two, two, three, four, five. Five. Positive or negative five? Positive five. Why positive? Going up. Going up. Very good. And now, run, I'm over here currently. Which way do I go, right or left? Right. right. How many? One, One two, two, three, four, five. Oh. Positive or negative five? Positive. Positive, because Positive, we're going to the? Yeah. Right. right. What is this slope then, ultimately? One. One. One, so this is a slope of one. Wait. Yes. But, like, let's say you're going down and you're going to the right. Very we're good question, negative. we're doing that now. Okay. So if we started here, rise over run, do we go up, down, left, or right first? To get to this point. Down. Down. Very good. Down. So if we're going down, how far down do we go? Five. Five. So negative five. And now we're currently here. Do we go up, down, left, or right now? Left. Left, which is left five. Left is positive or negative? Negative. Negative five. What does this cancel to? One. So it's still one. Hallelujah. Let's talk about, ooh, take out the green, this line here. I want you guys to realize that this is a positive slope, no matter how you look at it. Because we're always going up and right, which is positive. And, like Cornelius said, if you go down <laughs> and left, or Sorrento, or whatever your name is. So, if you go down and left, it's also positive. Well, what a good teacher. So, positive slope. The trick is, you guys, positive slope sort of looks like the stock market. It starts down and goes up to the right. Okay. So on an SAT or any other test like that, if you see a line like this, you immediately know it's positive slope. Any questions? It's a positive slope. Let's talk about this guy. Which point do you want to start? Here or here? Top one? Top one. Yeah. Top one. You start at the top one. Okay, to get the slope from this point to the second, up, down, left, or right first? Down. Down how many? Four. Four. Three. 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 <laughs> <laughs> we are counting. <laughs> so down three. Now up, down, left, or right? Right. right. And is that positive or negative? Positive. 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 Very good. What's this slope? Negative one. Negative one. Great job. Negative slope. Positive slope, negative slope. Mm. Okay. In a second, it's going to get a lot harder, but not yet. Let's do the following two that you see. Do you see horizontal line first? Yeah, it's in diagonal. Where is the horizontal line at what value? Two. Two? Two. Okay. What's the equation of all horizontal lines? Y equals or X equals? You know it? Y equals. Y equals, good job. So this is the line Y equals two. Okay. Let's go ahead and quickly calculate the slope. What's this point right here? Two. What two? Zero. 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 Very good. Zero. Two. And I'm gonna pick a point out of the random Zero. sky. Five. Is that desk still too still too small? Five two. Desk was floating on your knees. It's funny. You can like walk out of it. 
Never mind. <laughs> Never mind. Okay, so let's get the slope between two points. You know how to do it, right? The slope is? Difference of y's, difference of x's, correct? Y2, y2. M equals, so this is the official equation. But what you, what am I doing? But what you don't realize right off the bat is that we were just doing that two seconds ago. Uh, whoa. We're doing the difference in the y's. Difference in the y's was how far up and down we go. So what's the difference in the y's here? None. Zero. Zero. You're getting two minus two. Yeah. And then the difference in the x's? Five minus zero. This is zero over anything is zero. So a slope of a horizontal line is always zero. A slope of a horizontal line, always zero. And what about this line? Where is it? Vertical. Vertical, Vertical at? X equals three. Negative three. Negative two. Negative two, I'm getting? I can do math. <laughs> the accent. <laughs> All right. The equation of a vertical line is always what? X equals. X equals, in this case, negative two. Let's go ahead and calculate the slope of this guy. Elevator. <laughs> Slow elevator. Yeah, safety first. <laughs> Boop. Okay, I have to turn. <laughs> All right, slope. What is this point here? Two. What two? Zero. Zero. Two. Two zero. Negative two. Negative two. <laughs> I could do math too, man. <laughs> What's this point? Awkward. Three. Maybe uh, negative one, two, two, three, four. Negative two, three. Sounds good. Let's calculate the slope. Difference in the y's. Y minus y is? Three. Three, three. three minus zero, zero equals three. Very good. Difference in the x's? Three, four. Zero. Negative two minus negative two equals zero. Uh -oh. What happens when you divide by zero? Uh, no no solution. This is called undefined slope. Undefined. <laughs> undefined. Okay. So you could either choose to recall Wait. that horizontal lines have a zero slope, or you can calculate the slope yourself and see that. Or you can choose to recall that vertical lines have an undefined slope. Or if you don't want to memorize it, you can simply derive it yourself by calculating, picking any two points on the line, and noticing when you have zero in the denominator, it's undefined. Um, bell pepper, could you define, <laughs> turn, turn your calculator on, please. And in your calculator, write three divided by zero. What does it Error say? Error divided by zero. Error divided by zero, so it's undefined. Okay, flip the page, please. Air is the wrong Air. Wait, what's got it? Go to the air. <laughs> got to. <laughs> You'd think in the air message they would put a space between go and to. Okay, so you guys can calculate the slope between the following two points now. Oh, yes. Let me spare you the secrecy. The, most big, the biggest mistake that people make is that they put the difference in x's in the numerator. We're not going to do that, are we? No. 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 <laughs> yeah, are we going to do that? Math. <laughs> that would not be fun. So what is the letter for slope in math world? M. M, very good. M equals um, difference. Just, yes? Uh, it doesn't really matter if we do which one you do first as long as it's the same order for x. Bravo. Exactly. Right? Oh. And y. And y. And y. Right. 